And thanks for joining us here at 6. A South Minneapolis elementary school hoping to build confidence in some of their youngest students and make their voices heard. Kindergarten and first graders at Friendship Academy of the Arts Charter School taking to the streets earlier today. Leah Bino joining us live now. And Leah, what is the message they are hoping to send to the community? Well, not only to the community, but also to these kids, and it's that they can be leaders and they can be comfortable and confident in the community that they are growing up in. Now, in the wake of the Derek Chauvin trial and then the shooting in Brooklyn Center and other situations that are part of this international conversation, the leaders here say all of that is weighing on young learners more than many people realize. I know I can, I know I can. Be, what I be what I want to be. Working to inspire and empower young students. Now let me see you dance. Come on. This is a rally. We're having a good time. Friendship Academy of the Arts Charter School Executive Director Dr. B. Charvez Russell and his staff have renewed focus on how recent events and encounters with police are impacting his littlest learners. We have been going through a lot here in Minnesota. Uh, with all the recent events. Our students are experiencing what we're experiencing. And when you get, uh, and when we talk to them about it, they have such a negative view of themselves. You know, they, 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 they view themselves as uh, less than. They view themselves as being targeted by the police. I'm talking about these are young students that are thinking that, you know, my skin is bad. 280 kindergarten through eighth graders here, 96 percent are black, 2 percent Latino, 2 percent white, 80 percent receive free and reduced school lunches. The new I Am campaign aims to change the narrative and build confidence for all. I am smart. I am smart. Yes, you are. Uh, we are about affirming you and who you are and then understanding how that intersects with other cultures in such a diverse area. Say I am. Taking their I am smart, I am beautiful signs to 38th Street, Russell believes fostering future leaders is part of carefully watching how quickly perspectives can change. When you ask them what they want to be when they grow up, one of the common things they say, a police officer, a firefighter, ain't that, ain't that the common thing? But if we don't watch it and, uh, and, and really work at changing that narrative, then, you know, we'll have less, less of our students who want to inspire to be protectors of our community. Now, the leaders here say this was very much inspired by high school students across the state who recently did a walkout and march. They say even these young learners, they wanted to do something and say this is just the beginning. We're live in South Minneapolis. Leah Bino, Fox 9. All right. Thanks, Leah.